So you want to know about CSA. Okay. Cloud Service Automation is a service brokering product created by a talented team at Hewlett Packard to automate the configuration and management of any IT operation. This automation is between providers of services and consumers who want their services. CSA is based on a service design approach of creating service offerings which are published to a catalog on a secure website where consumers can subscribe to those services in a self-service fashion. Still not clear? Let's try an analogy. Say you want some new stereo speakers. If you are like me, you'll start by checking your favorite retailer. Mine is Amazon. Performing a quick search for stereo speakers, I get a list of hundreds of speakers of different types and from different companies. A catalog of services, if you will. Now, no company would ever keep a warehouse full of all of these different speakers, and neither does Amazon. Amazon acts as a broker between you and the speaker companies. And when I place an order, Amazon coordinates the billing and shipping based on the contract they have with the providers of speakers. You can say Amazon has automated the process of how we purchase stuff. This is the same concept behind CSA and how it provides automation for the IT industry. Instead of providing commodities, CSA provides automation of setup, configuration, deployment, and lifecycle management of IT equipment and services. But that's not all CSA can do. Every business has a different way of running their operations. Additionally, they must satisfy regulatory requirements. HP knows these business processes are the DNA of a company's competitive advantage. That is why CSA is so tightly integrated with HP's award-winning operations orchestration. CSA and OO work together to define and automate many common IT business processes like setting up virtual machines, email servers, and configuring network switches. These business processes are designed and brokered through two user interfaces, the Service Management Console and the Marketplace Portal, or more commonly called the SMC and MPP. In order to deliver these automated operations, CSA creates an integration contract with the different service providers like HP Helion, Server Automation, Network Automation, and other HP products. CSA also has integrations with other third-party software and providers of services, including OpenStack, Chef, Puppet, VMware, Amazon Web Services, and Microsoft Azure, just to name a few. Other specialized integrations like HP's SiteScope are also available through CSA solutions on the HP Live Network website. CSA, like Amazon, has simplified the way you interact with providers. To ensure consistency and reliability, CSA provides design components associated with different providers. These components can be grouped together on a designer canvas to simplify the organization of different business operations. For example, say you have a vCenter host in your IT infrastructure. Using a service design, CSA can automate the creation, deployment, and configuration of a virtual machine into your environment. The service design gives you the capability to customize and configure that virtual machine so it can be created and configured over and over again. The cool thing about this service design concept is that you can create a service design as simple as a single component or as complex as hundreds of components. Part of the magic behind the CSA design experience is that each component can have an underlying set of lifecycle actions that relate to OO flows. This makes it possible to create a service design to meet any business process need. A design can be as simple as setting up a new user account or as complex as checking the inventory of equipment, configuring physical hardware, and billing the department for new IT services, all with a click 
of a mouse. The service design concept forms the foundation of CSA. Once a service design has been created and thoroughly tested, you can create a service offering and expose it to your users. You can think of this step as the way you create options you see when placing an order in Amazon. In our earlier example, these options could have been color, size, or quantity of speakers. This aspect of creating a service offering is CSA's way of customizing the pricing and marketing options for your services in the Marketplace Portal. In an enterprise organization, the IT service business manager usually controls when changes happen to the IT environment. In CSA, the service business manager role controls what services are visible to the consumer by publishing those service offerings to a catalog. Creating multiple catalogs is one way to provide control of service offering access to different users, groups, and organizations. Once items are in the catalog, they can be ordered by consumers through the Marketplace portal. Upon receipt of a subscription request, CSA determines from that request and the underlying service design what providers are needed to fulfill the order. Pending any defined approval policies, CSA then coordinates the automation required to create the new service instance. CSA was designed to perform all these automated business operations for an enterprise IT environment. However, cloud service providers, more commonly called CSPs, are quickly adopting CSA as a way to automate the services they provide to their customers. At first, cloud service providers managed all of their service designs, catalogs, and service offerings. But now, more and more of their customers are wanting to publish their own services. For example, Company A wants to create their own service offerings and catalogs and then provide them for a fee to the rest of the world. In contrast, Company B wants to create their own service designs, offerings, and catalogs to be used privately to create hybrid cloud services integrated with their own IT facilities. CSA is expanding multi-tenant capability will provide cloud service providers the ability to give their customers full control of the service design and publishing aspects of CSA. Multi-geography IT enterprise environments will also benefit from this feature, allowing them to distribute CSA's functionality to their local business teams. The popularity of CSA is steadily increasing because its customers have come to realize the significant cost savings, efficiencies, and consistencies created by the service design and self-service model. CSA started out as an IT enterprise product to provide services to corporate IT. However, it is fast becoming the automation provider of business services to the cloud. This transformation from traditional IT is a direct result of an expansion of IT responsibilities to individual users. This means that the lines between providers and consumers are rapidly collapsing towards a self-service IT cloud environment. Now, don't you want to be part of that cloud transformation? HP's cloud service automation can help you start that transformation today.